I really shouldn't. Well, we're off to a great start. Hey guys, T Ram Chuan here, and today we're playing um Jade. I feel a soft texture on the tip of my fingers. They make me sit on what feels like a cinema seat. Oh, it's just that. Whoa. Yeah. Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. But where are we? In the very... In our very private planetarium. Lucky guys. It's our planetarium. It's just... And it's just private because nobody comes here. Our very private planetarium. Well, I've never been in the planetarium before. And I must say, it truly is beautiful. I'll say. Yeah. I knew you would like it. I am the best. Thanks, thanks. Yes, you are. Hey, John. You see the music you're hearing right now? Um... I'm not exactly sure I can see music. Well, technically, he doesn't see music. See? Shush. Plus, with v vitral equalizer thingies now, we can see music. So, yes. So, yes. Music. Well, this is music made with the data sent from dying stars. Eh? Yeah. I don't really get how it works. Or what it truly means, but it's cool. Well, it's pretty intriguing, but it sounds cool. It's conceptual. I'm astounded by the beauty of the show. Eh, I used to dislike Player Tam since it's not really a real representation of the universe. Yeah, but it's still beautiful, isn't it? True. I stop being your usual rational self. It's kind of like a magic stuff. You like it because of the magic, not because of the stuff. Well, there is that. Well, she's right. Like, do I need to know your brawl size? Okay, we're going into that twerk territory again. Hang on to your hats, folks! Awkward silence. No? That was a joke. Yeah. A joke. I'm actually in 90A. Jade, I don't think John wants to hear that. Oh well, you know, it doesn't bother me. I saw there were corsets for men. We were here to look at stars, weren't we? Yeah, but I'm curious about these corsets. It's not very new, but I discovered it a few days ago. And to be honest, they're pretty cool. Okay, we got it. Corsets for men and bra size. Now shush. This conversation though. That's because she has a padded bra. Hey, that's not even true. I slaps Jade softly. Ouch. I'm surprised by the things I can think. Why am I even thinking about this? Softly, softly, everything is reiterated. Ouch! You hit me so hard. Yes, I did, but you deserved it. Yeah, did she deserve such a hard slap? Come on now, look at her face. And her eyes. This is me, minus the slap, this is me playing Five Nights at Treasure Island. Don't judge me. I'm not. She's stronger than she seems to be. I'm not... I, I'll try not to talk about brawl size again. No, I will never talk about brawl size again. Next time y'all talk about brawl sizes, I'ma put you through a wall. My cheek is sore. You want a magic kiss? No. You sure? I put on strawberry flavored lipstick this morning. Mmm. Think twice before you speak, Jade. It's not some random lipstick. It's strawberry fa flavored lipstick. I am thinking. Okay then. I use gently kisses, leaves a kiss on Jade's cheek. Wow, it really is magic. Yeah, it's all gone now. There you go. Yay! Now I smell strawberry. 
It's like a giant jam jar. Of course, we should leave. How about we go to the restaurant? Mmm, yeah, I'm hungry. Restaurant. Unanimously. And to the restaurant we go, get some food. Back to the crossway. Is the restaurant far away? Because I'm really hungry. Yeah, don't worry. It's like 500 meters away. But this restaurant really is something. They sell ice cream with chocolate and cheese. Um... Chocolate and cheese? I'm not really feeling it. It's like so unique. Hey, breathe after eating the their choco cheese ice cream is unique to chocolate and cheese. It sounds disgusting. It sounds disgusting, but it tastes amazing. Well, there is the whole um cheese cake and chocolate. It's like a big party in your mouth. Plus, you eat the meal and the dessert. What a time saver. So, they only sell cocoa cheese ice cream. No, no, they have sandwiches, burgers, and all that. But we always order cocoa cheese ice cream because this is their best product they sell. And I include in the Wii. Okay, I always ordered cocoa cheese ice cream. Just thinking about it makes me want to throw up. Don't judge before you taste it. After all, both are made with milk and cream. So, because sugar and salt are two minerals, they're the same? That's not what I said. You'll taste it. I need to find a way to avoid tasting this chocolate cheese ice cream. It really sounds disgusting. For me, it's not that disgusting. I guess I'm right. Yeah, come on, John, be a man. Eat some ice cream. It's not very pretty on the outside, nor on the inside. It, tru it truly is the best restaurant you could find on Earth. You know, it's kind of like Donner Kib... Kib... What? It often looks bad from the outside, but it's so good. I don't know what a Donner ka Kebab is. Yeah, Donner Kebab, so good. Enough. I'm hungry. Wait, we got we're going to contemplate this beautiful restaurant before we enter in. Aren't you the one who said he was hungry? Yeah. We enter the restaurant. All right, I'll give this place credit. It does look pretty nice, and it looks like we're getting a new character. The restaurant doesn't look so bad, except the paintings. They make me feel uncomfortable. Yes, it does. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Oh, we got a new customer. Friend, family, or stranger. Here's our new friend. You can call him John. Actually, my name is John. So, our table. There you go. This is our table. You really have a problem with what belongs to you. The waitress looks very familiar with Jade and Aes. And she somehow managed to pull off blue hair. So cute. Not my type, but cute. Whoa, John. Let's not be a Romeo person here. Jade, let me guess. A cocoa cheese ice cream? Yay! Well, I'm going to break the routine and take an Arrow Green Tea. And for you, young boy, cocoa cheese ice cream too. But, shh. Okay. There's no use trying to get out of it, bro. You're gonna eat it. And you're gonna like it. Yes, you're just very submissive. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Of course you're not. Yes, yes, of course you're not. Not at all. I feel, a bit sarc I feel a bit of a sarcastic tone. Oh, really? This conversation is enriching. Yeah. Here's your tea and your ice creams. Wonder why we still make these ice creams. You're the only one eating them, Jade. 
I know, but I'm not... But I'm the only one who comes here anyway. <laughs> I'm going to head back to the kitchen. Wait, why don't you stay with us, Reen? Reen? Yes, my name is Reen. Sorry, I should have introduced myself. I it's fine. Reen is a cute name. Like I said, John, you're... You're pulling off that Romeo man thing. And it comes from friends. Okay. It's like... Hard to describe. Just say Reen. Okay, then. She takes a seat next to me. She smells like Calais. A bit peppery, but sweet at the same time. So it looks like you, Anise, and Jade know each other for quite a while. Well, they come here often, and we don't have many customers. This is the big city, you know. Jade interrupts her and speaks with her mouth full. He doesn't. What? He doesn't know the city. You, you're new here? He's not just new here. We found him in the forest. Wait, so you kidnapped him then? No, 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 no. We just found him and he appears to have some kind of amnesia. Party rocking too hard. He decided to stay. Oh, it's not like it, I, if I had anywhere else to go. Yeah. Sorry for party rocking. Oh, I see. John, you're not eating your ice cream. A look at the weird thing on the table. I can't even call that an ice cream. It's like a chocolate ice cream with some kind of melted cheese on it. Y yes, I am. Hesitate and take a piece of the thing. Oh, God. I think I'm going to throw up. It tastes like puke married poop and had the ceremony in my mouth. Very charming. Hey, people are trying to eat here. They can I have your ice cream? Wow, wait. You're already done with yours? No, no, Ice helped me. No, I do. Come on. She grabs my ice cream and starts to eat it. Even the smell is still here. Ugh. And I'm still hungry. Well, I'm sorry you don't like it. I don't either though. The cook is gone since we're not in the lunch time slot, but if you want, we have chocolate bars and little things like this. No, no, thank you. Ais takes the last sip from her teacup. I should order some of that tea more often. Well, all the sugar you put in it, you shouldn't. Just one teaspoon. Yes, of course, just one. And I only ate one ice cream. But we both know it's a lie. And it's getting dark again. Yes, because you cannot help but lie. I clear my throat roughly. Shots fired. Hmm? Nothing. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt me. I am confused. Renine seems nervous. She looks like a nervous person. Maybe they don't act like this when they're alone. I am untouchable. Ooh. You sure? Mm-hmm. She nods and smiles. And what if Reen stops making cocoa cheese ice cream? Impossible. As long as they are goat and milk and animals with milk on earth, cocoa cheese ice cream will rule the world. Prepare yourself, guys. Well, we might close down soon. Why? Yes, why? It has something to do with the lack of, uh, people, doesn't it? It's just a restaurant. Restaurants close every day. Well, well, you see... Well, you literally are the two customers we have. Sometimes people come, but never come back. No wonder why they don't have many customers, since their only specialty is the cocoa cheese ice cream. I want to sell something more. We are prime premium customers. We're worth 20 customers. What would you do if we closed down anyway? I don't know. Maybe become a teacher? A teacher? Ais, I think she's not totally aware of what she's saying. Jay grabs a wrist and checks her pulse. She's alive. Jade, it's not her choice. Yes, I don't want to close down either. Then 
Why did you say you would close down soon? She didn't say that. Yes, I said maybe we would. It's not my decision anyway. A superhero has to be prepared to die for what he believes in. True. But she's not a superhero. Superhero ice cream maker, it's the same. I don't know, John. I mean, someone who makes ice cream is a superhero in my eyes. I think you should leave. We're closing soon. We'll be back as usual. <laughs> bye bye. Rumble. Have a nice evening. He sleeps some money on the table and gets up. They really paid for this? I mean, this. Bye. He had to close. He had. He head to the door and leave the restaurant. I can't believe they're going to close down. Don't worry, I'm sure they're not going to close down. Yes, maybe she said that just so you two would stop arguing. We weren't arguing, though. Anyway, if she closes down, I'll steal the rest. Yeah, that's the spirit. Actually, I don't blame them. If you weren't difficult, you wouldn't be starving now. Who, who? Who on this earth, in this universe, can eat something made of chocolate and cheese? <clears throat> Ch chocolate cheesecake. <clears throat> Me. Yeah, well, I pity your mouth. We follow Elise and head back to the crossway. Ah. I'm gonna die. It's been two days since you've been here, and you already said this twice. Do you know what it is to be hungry? Actually, yes. I feel like a pregnant woman, but like, permanently pregnant. Kinky. Hmm? Well, because you know. To be pregnant, you have to eat lots. Oh god, shut up, John. Shut up. I don't get it. I think what John wants to say is... I cover his mouth with my hand. Is it relevant? Mm -hmm. Her lips are wet. As if she's trying... Keeps trying to talk my hand going to be all sticky. Disgusting. It's a kidnapper. Actually, she's not a kid, so... Get off her. What? Is she serious or what? She punches me in the face. Smackdown. And that's all I can remember. And that's all we have for today. This is T Ram 21 signing out. Comment, rate, subscribe for more. See you guys next.